Hey, Don Stanley here from 3 Rhino Media, where I give you marketing tips in three minutes or less. And today we are talking about day four of our 30-day challenge. And we've been talking about goals, goal setting, why it's so critical to get yourself started with them, to keep yourself going, to hit targets, because there's so many different things that you can do. And today, we're going to be talking about three tips to keep yourself going, because we've already talked about when you hit... Day 11 through day 21, most people struggle. So here are three tips that I've learned over the last 25 years, I hate to say that, but 25 years of studying what makes people break through those barriers. So number one is to be prepared and be realistic that off days are going to come and be ready to attack those. So let's say, for example, you are working on eating more healthy know that you might have a party or a wedding coming up or something that you're going to be at and there is going to be stuff that is not healthy to eat there. So being prepared, what I mean by that is what I would do is I would eat ahead of time knowing that I want to fill my body with healthy stuff and then be prepared that some people might approach me and say, Don, why aren't you eating this cake or why aren't you doing this? And just be ready with an answer instead of being sheepish about it. Say, hey, I'm doing a 30-day challenge. This looks really good, but uh, I'm investing in myself for these 30 days. If you could help keep me accountable, if you see me leaning towards that cake, just say, Don, get away from it. That would be great. And what you'll see and what you'll find is people are going to be willing to help you. So be prepared that those things are going to happen. And off days, maybe you just, you're just you sick or maybe your technology isn't working or something like that. And it's a little bit harder to eat right on those days, but be prepared for it. Don't expect everything to go perfectly because it's not. Too many people do this, which is step number two, focus on your forward progress. Don't focus on being perfect. You are not going to be perfect in your 30 days. There's going to be some days where you do big things, some days where you do little things, but keep moving forward, little step forward progress, like the penny a day doubling every day is going to make a bigger impact than focusing on perfection. So my mantra for you is this, don't be paralyzed by perfection, be powered by progress. That's one of the mantras that I have to remind myself because I'm a recovering perfectionist. Number three is to visualize all the other people who are going to benefit from what you are doing. So if we get too much focused on ourselves and our own minds, we tend to focus on some of the struggles and hardships. But let's say you are trying to eat healthy. For me, being a dad of some ki younger kids, I might focus on, hey, the reason I'm eating well is I want to have more energy to be able to play with my kids, or I want to be around longer for my kids, or I want to be a better role model for my kids, whatever it is. Think of others. And Eric Greitens talks about this in his book, uh, Resilience. Eric Greitens is a former Navy SEAL. Great, great book, has some great information in there. But that when we get out of our own minds thinking of only serving ourselves and we serve others, we tend to be able to handle struggle better. So step number one, be a realistic, prepare for the off days. Number two, focus on making progress no matter what. Even if it isn't huge progress, little bits add up. And number three, visualize all the other people who are going to benefit from you taking action, whether they're family, friends, clients, anybody. Think of serving others. So that's your tip for today. Tomorrow, we're going to talk about some of the different tools and different formats for working with video marketing, moving from goals to talking to video. Until then, know that I'm cheering you on and have a super awesome day.